Slat Nam Collective. Thank you so much for joining. Welcome to Creator Connections Readings. My name is Jean, and this is going to be a collective reading. So if you resonate with the title, this is probably your reading, right? Um, just take what resonates and leave what doesn't, of course. Always trust your intuition, all of the good things. Whoa. Somebody really wants to say something, or somebody really wants something to be known, or you really want to know something, because these cards were like, um, yeah. So we have the journey card, okay. And we have body mind. Mm, okay. Okay, collective. I'm already getting, unfortunately, this is not going to be like the best message that somebody wants to hear. Like there's, there's, uh, <laughs> there, there's a need, there's a need to go on some sort of um, a journey. Like once again, it's an inner journey. And the, the reason why I'm saying this isn't like the best message is because this energy feels a little bit stale. It feels a little bit like, 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 <sighs> still. You know, that's the kind of vibe I'm getting here, okay? Um, the re the reason why, why I don't know, like, maybe maybe there's a need for you to meditate. Like, I feel like this collective, ugh, this collective is kind of stuck on some kind of, like, past karmic love situation, okay? Um, especially with the love card here as well. There's some sort of, like, balance. This body-mind card is actually giving me, okay, okay. There's some sort of imbalance in regards to your um in regards to your love energy. The, the, I don't know why, but this is this is making me feel like there's some sort of entity attached to your love body, your love field, or the aspects uh, the chakra points in your in your etheric body with which you manifest from from where you manifest love from so i don't know what like so, like say for instance your love language is like acts of service and words of encouragement like you manifest love with your with your solar plexus in your throat for instance i feel like there's some sort of like weird energy attaching itself to like those specific um points that's making you that's making you manifest like remanifesting um shitty situations but i feel like i feel like this actually feels like some sort of like a divine archer coming in to slay that entity okay so you're about to go on some sort of like journey um that body mind card gave me a lot of like um like clear visions now okay you're about to go on some sort of like journey to to actually um to heal this, to heal this um, thing that's been troubling your love life or something like that, okay? Um, <laughs> for some of you, I'm actually getting, for some of you as well, this is actually something that is, that like, like somebody keeps sending you, somebody who's watching you, who is in some kind of like, I'm hearing competition with you or something like that, competition maybe with this with this um eight of pentacles because you're getting some sort of wish fulfillment somebody in competition with you is actually sending this like conflict energy or this like um entity to you okay they're sending this the seven of spades energy to you I'm feeling this this is specifically this is specifically in regards to your love life but like you're not even really focused too much on your love life but but the, the intention is to is to exactly the queen of wands uh, the queen of wands the witch the five of spades conflict you're not really focused even on your love life too much but their intention this person's intention is to just put you in some kind of like inner conflict so that you don't want to I'm hearing that you don't want to carry on or that you don't I'm hearing like throw away your wish fulfillment or something like that. Yeah, so that you can be left out in the cold or be in poverty or not have this financial new beginning and be in this nine of pentacles. I'm I'm even feeling this person is trying to keep you on like this never ending this never ending journey of healing, this never ending um yeah, they they just want you to keep fighting non-stop. This is so fucking lame. Like this person. I feel like this is because of some sort of money or because you have money or because you know how to manifest money or something like that. This person wants your energy. 
this person wants your energy. They want they want this five of pentacles for you, and they want your ten of pentacles. They want you on this constant journey of needing to balance and heal yourself. They want you to constantly um, like lose money. They want you to constantly lose stability, constantly be in, in, in conflict and this, this wounded warrior vibes, okay? Um, I don't see that happening though for you, collective. She's even putting, she's even putting like blockages in your way. That's a stale energy that I was getting. She, she, because the queen of wands, right? She's, she's putting the eight of wands. That's the message. So if you need to meditate, collective, like clear your energy, okay? God is coming in with some sort of clarity um, if you meditate, okay? God is going to come in with some sort of like, I'm even hearing like a divine fire. Um... So yeah, the, the scribe, perception, eight of swords, this person, this person is doing a whole lot to try and, I'm hearing snuff out your flame or snuff out your light, keep you stuck, have you look at yourself in, in ways that aren't um, true. Um, I'm feeling even like God is about to push you on some sort of like journey away from this energy as well. Um, some of you might be relocating, some of you have relocated. Some of you need to relocate. Yeah, five of wands. This person wants to bring in... This person is really, really manifesting um, a lot of... Oh, my God. I feel like this person... Ew. I feel like this person has some sort of really intense obsession with you, Collective. Like, because the love card keeps showing itself. Um, She has some sort of intense... He or she has some sort of intense... Um, obsession with you, but I feel like it's because of, like, your energy. It feels like it's your, um, <laughs> your vibes. Uh, this person wants to be seen as you. This person wants to... I'm, I'm hearing this person wants to speak the way you speak. This person wants to... Wants people to look at them the way they look at you. This people... This, this person wants to be you. This person wants to be... Um, they want, they want your expression, they want your, um, I'm hearing lifeline, oh my god, what the fuck, um, but, but God is saying, God is saying that, that this, 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 um, yeah, this, this inner journey that you're gonna be, that, that he's pushing you on once again is, is gonna be, is gonna be allowing you to basically, um, clear away any kind of energy within you that's still in, in resonance with this energy, um, this person is doing a lot of magic, okay, because the Ace of Wands kind of just flew as I was being drawn to the Queen of Wands as well. This person is doing a lot of magic to to try and fuck up your, your um, what you've got going for you, okay. This person might even be lying on you. This person might be, like, um, sharing a lot of, like, like misinformation I'm hearing or, 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 or untruths or something like that. Um... This person is definitely watching you, like, they keep watching you, and, like, I'm I'm getting this vibe of this, <laughs> this person watches you, or they, like, for some of you, they might, like, they might be watching, I'm seeing somebody, get, um, walk out of their building, and this person is watching them, for some of you, it's online, for some of you, they're just, like, stalking your, you energetically, I don't know exactly, like, it's, it's whatever, right, but this person, like, keeps watching you, or, like, like, find, like, tries to find out things about you, and then tries to, like, use this information that they know to kind of like I'm hearing like discredit you or something like that okay but um excuse me <laughs> um I feel like I feel like this person trying to do that the whole time is actually leading to some sort of like they keep manifesting they keep manifesting this energy for themselves they keep manifesting this um Five of Pentacles, Five of Swords, Nine of um, Wands, energy for themselves. I feel like any kind of, any time they, they manifest stability for themselves, any time they try and manifest, um, I'm hearing off of your energy or off of your, um, once again, expression or the way people perceive you or something like that. Like, every time they try to do that, they're, they're met with... Um, I'm hearing, I'm hearing inconceivable and irreconcilable differences, which is like divorce energies. So it's, it's basically like they're, they're being rejected by, by cosmic, by the cosmos the entire time. Okay. 
Um, you're about to have victory and, and some sort of, I'm hearing the last laugh, uh, collective. You're, you're about to see something happen with this person or hear something happening to this person. Or you're just about to see their karma. I actually want to get one more, one more card here. Um, just to like finish off the vibes. You're about to receive some sort of like... I don't know, divine clarity in regards to what's actually happening with this person. I'm getting, maybe you're just even going to understand that this person is like exactly so fucking ridiculously pathetic. Um, and that they're not even worth your time. And oh my god, that sounds so mean to say even, right? But like, but I mean, it is what it is, right? Like you're just here sitting, trying to fucking do your thing. <laughs> and this person is just like, me, 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 like energetically, you know, and, I feel like even other people are starting to be like, <sighs> so yeah, that's what I'm sharing with you. Uh, thank you collective. That was your reading. Please do consider liking and subscribing. You're about to have victory and be very, very happy with, with, um, the outcome. You're about to have the last laugh. Uh, I will see you again for another reading. Satnam. Bye.